Hello everyone and welcome to the lab. This is a collection of games created by Valve, I believe. There's a whole bunch of stuff in there. You got like bow and arrows, you have the aperture robot repair, and a bunch of other stuff. So we're just gonna go ahead, get in here, and we're just gonna screw around with some games. Okay, so if I step back here, I should have a thingy right here that says start. Boom, we started. Woo! Hello, test traveler. Hi. And welcome to the Aperture Science Subuniverse Exploration Center. Thank you, I guess. What now? Oh shit, I wanna go in there. Let me do that. All my friends have left me. Move forward, navigate. Please use your spatial reassignment Ooh. to move forward. Spatial reassignment. This is the Aperture Science Face Mounted oh. Portal Sphere. It is your gateway to a vast continuum of undiscovered worlds. I love this because it's undiscovered worlds Shut up. They also contain undiscovered diseases, oh. natural disasters, airborne toxins, and apex predators that hunt humans for sport. Okay, I guess I'll spare on your face now. I'll take my chances of that, I suppose. What I was gonna say, guys, is it looks really realistic. I especially like these can the portal sphere on your face. Woman, please do so now. Stop. Yeah, it's really realistic, like with the controllers, especially because they look like the real controllers. The portal sphere is not on your face yet. Please put it on your face now. Gah! Here, are you happy? I hope you're happy. Jeez. We're going to Vesper Park, Washington, United States. Okay, that's cool. Uh, I'm alright with that, I guess. Okay, now this is just pure insanity, guys. This is freaking photorealistic. Look at that. Why in the hell? It's, I'm pretty sure this is made with like actual photo stuff. And they just made it into like a... What the hell are you? Get out of here. I don't want you here. Maybe I do. Maybe you can be my friend. Come here. Touch your bum. You like that? You like that, yeah? You like I'm gonna touch your bum? Okay, good. Good stuff. Now, I'm going up the hill. See you later. Oh, now I have to hop up here. There we are. Guys! Holy crap! Look at that! <laughs> this is really neat, guys, because uh, most of the games that I've played for VR so far have like a cartoony kind of feel to them, but this is not cartoony, okay? This is real life. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go run away to virtual reality forever. And also, damn Washington, you looking good! Okay, so um, I have to go to the lab, so I'm just gonna press uh, no buttons because I want to go up here and have a look. Oh, oh my. Alright, there's another face over here. Uh, oh, there's a South Vista? I can't reach the South Vista, I'm gonna have to go here first. And then hop up to the South Vista. Oh, that's where I was, wasn't it? Ah, hang on a second. So this is the North Face. Boom. All right. Well, I think that's pretty much it here. You can just look around in different places. Ooh, feels like I'm gonna fall down. I don't want to fall down. Let's go to the lab. There. Oh, just put my face in this thing. Boom. No? No? Oh, here it is again. Boom. <laughs> I like that. I like that a lot. Now, here I am. I can use my uh, thingamabob to move wherever I want. There's a freaking arcade machine right here, which is nice. We also got uh, something down here, and uh, ooh, secret shop. Guys, I'm going to the secret shop. That sounds like a good place to go. Let me just grab that thing and put it on my face. Against all odds, test traveler of Pocket Universe Lab 8 has survived. Yay, go me! Woo! Okay, so I said I'd do archery, or I thought I'd be doing archery, but then again, guys, I missed out on the aperture robot repair. I wasn't able to do that when I had the Vive because um, it wasn't my Vive and they wouldn't give me access to it. So now I gotta try that one, okay? So we'll, we'll do some robot repairing today. Here we go. Just gonna get out in this bubble. Hang on a second, guys. This is not what I want. This is a slingshot, apparently. That's, I mean, that's neat and all, but that's not what I was gonna get. Here we go. Um, shoot. Oh, okay. Great. Let's go back again. I'm gonna find the right place. Hey, am, am I up for calibration? Nope. Okay, here's what I want to do, guys. This is the robot repair right here. Look at that. Robot repair. Experiment Johnson Micro traverses to Aperture Science where a damaged AT D7796 robot requires assistance. So that's what happened to Lab 44. Okay, let's do it. Boom. Okay, as you guys can tell, this one is a little bit different. Really confusing when I got in there. It stopped recording and I had to set it up again. All right, we're here now, okay? He's telling me I gotta charge something. I think the multi-tool station charging thing is over here. Good. Here you go. Now, press the button on the multi -tool. Oh, which one? This one? Whoa. Good. Oh, okay, yeah. That moves Please me around. Your radiation suit at this time. No. no. Suit Good. I don't, I don't, I wanna be naked, thank There's you. A cabinet of drawers in your repair station. Please locate it and open a drawer. What? This one over here? This? Huh? Huh? Drawer? Hey! Now close the drawer and open the correct drawer. 
Ah, so this one over here, the one with the green on it. This one? This one? Oh, this one? You have now uh, the hang on. Yeah, uh, some really old, old cake. Can I eat it? No? Okay, never mind. Never mind. Never mind. This one. This is the drawer. Ta-da! Look at that. It's a bunch of people in an office people. working. Goodbye. Are we good now? We good? What's going on? Do I need to open that drawer again? Seriously? What do you got me doing here? There. As explained in your orientation, you should, of course, never look directly into the drawer. Room sensors indicate you are currently looking directly into the drawer. You have just interfered with an Aperture Science Pocket Universe cap. You Sorry. <laughs> Close the drawer to initiate Contaminated Pocket Universe Contingency Pro. Good. Yeah. Contaminated Pocket Universe Incinerate. Opening drawers has been removed from your list of responsibilities. Good. Please locate the service bay door lever and pull it. It's a door lever. Door lever, door lever. Okay, that looks like a door lever over here, guys. I'm going to try and pull that thing. There. Now serving. One. Okay. Come on in. Are you ready? You ready to be served? You look nice. Get in here. Ah. Hello, Atlas. We meet again. You look like you need some repairs done. It's a good thing I am an aperture robot repair person thingy. Are you ready for this shit? He doesn't look like he is. He looks like he's not in good shape right now. Damn, dude. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Yep, that's fine. That's fine. As you can see from the schematic hologram, all Aperture brand robots can be repaired by anyone with even a rudimentary understanding of Thank God. mechanical engineering. <laughs> to begin repairing this unit, attach your multi-tool to its faceplate and pull as forcefully as possible. Okay, I'm supposed to attach my multi-tool to, multi to this faceplate face plate and pull as forcefully as possible? Ah! <laughs> Whoa, shit. Hang on, hang on, hang on. What the hell is this? Oh, all the way over here? There we go. Holy crap. This one right here. The what? Hang on. Stop. Stop. Slow down. Slow down, sir. Please take your time. Up to 30 seconds. At which point the thermal reactor currently uncoupled from its heat exchange unit will detonate. Alert lacks and deploy. Okay, I heard a lot of things then, guys, and I'm really confused. Just gonna move this over here, okay? What am I looking for? Take your time. 15 seconds. Just gonna rotate it a bunch. How about this? There. What's going on? Sir? There's so much shit here. Look at all this shit, guys. Look at all this shit. This is crazy. This is crazy. What are you saying? What now? What now? Press this thing. Uh, I don't know. I'm just gonna wait for things to blow up. I'm ready. Yay! I'm sorry, dude. I think I broke you. Good. All responsibilities have been removed from your list of responsibilities. Yay! I don't believe it. What kind of robot can handle the simplest? Oh, you, can, you you can go to hell. Okay, I, I don't. Congratulations on your quota filling promotion, by the way. Thank you. You've opened all our eyes to what humans can achieve when you put your tiny little minds to it. You know. For your own safety, please vacate this station immediately. In virtual reality, you're really big. Okay. So let's be honest. Your first day's been a bit of a disaster. It's probably not the worst thing if you die. That's really mean, and I think uh, I'm really sad now. Thank you. Okay, what the hell is happening now, guys? Repair what are you? Station recycling in progress. Oh, good. Okay, yeah, you recycle that stage. I need it back I again. Thanks. I know. At first, I was against this human diversity outreach program, but now, watching you flail around like a sweaty pile of ham, I see I was wrong. It's hilarious. Honestly, I think you're overqualified for robot repair. Thank I you. I've got a better assignment for you. Repair station recycling complete. Thank you for your participation. That's a recording. He has to say that. What are you doing to me? Goodbye. Do you, wait. Oh. Oh God. Oh God. I'm. I'm in portal, guys. What's happening? Oh Jesus! You don't. Don't make me do. Oh. Okay. Okay. Great. Great. Okay. So I guess that was uh, Pocket Universe number one or something. That's a, That's Aperture Robot Repair. Is that it? I thought there was more to it. I thought I was actually gonna repair a robot, but I should have known the difference. With Aperture, nothing ever seems to be what it is, okay? So yeah, there you go. I think I'm going to end it here, guys, because I, I did quite a bit, even though I didn't really do that much. 
I visited a few places. This is really cool, guys. Like, uh, as I said a bunch of times already, it's a really realistic game, which is really neat because, as I said, the other things that I've been playing are kind of more on the cartoony side. So it's just really cool to experience all this stuff in virtual reality. Yeah. So uh, I don't know what I'm going to be doing with uh, with virtual reality, guys. I'm, I'm not even over in the center of the screen. I don't know what's going to be happening with this, guys. If you have any games you want me to play, please leave them down below. It's kind of hard to figure out what games people want to see on the channel, um, especially with virtual reality. It's also new and whatnot. So yeah, if you have any game suggestions, leave them down below, and I'm going to end this video here. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, don't forget to leave a like, and I will see you next time. Goodbye.